all right guys welcome back to the channel today's project not a fun one so the anchor light way up there has two bulbs um, the forward one is burned out and it's virtually impossible to reach with the boat in the water um, what we're gonna try to do is got a step ladder here and just be really careful doing this that's not a good height to fall from um, but you can see get up here a little bit there's one two bolts at the bottom of where the anchor light tube comes in there's two on the other side also and they go into that bottom plate or I guess you could say top plate of the mast and uh, of course they're not captive on the top side so when you spin the nuts everything just spins once it loosens a little bit what I'll be doing and I've already got these two nuts removed I'm gonna be removing the antenna for the track vision and then try to move that just far enough forward on the boat where I can get to the top of those bolts and uh, we'll see if that allows us to rotate the anchor light tube down to a safer position and then uh, see if we can replace that burned out bulb okay it seems to be working so far um, I'd be getting a video of this as I'm doing it but it's just a really precarious spot to be holding a camera and working at the same time but step ladder is now moved over to this side um, just go up here and show you guys you can see I've removed the three of the four nuts that hold the track vision on and I've left that last one um, on but loosened almost the whole way so it's allowed it to just rotate you know off center of that plate and now I should have access to the top side of those nut or bolts for the anchor light tube next step try to loosen those guys up and and get that anchor tube rotated down okay two down and two to go I'm gonna move the ladder back around the thing to be careful with here now is when that last one comes loose is uh, to not let the, the tube just fall probably easier said than done but here goes nothing okay this is probably one of the most sketchy things I've ever done um, but it is it is down and all of that worked it just rotated down uh, getting the last bolt out was a little challenging because you know it's a one-handed grab you're kind of holding the the pole in place as you're pulling the last bolt out and unfortunately I did drop it and uh, it is it is forever gone in the water so we are making a, a run to Ace Hardware today to try to find a replacement um, but uh, even if we can't um, honestly three bolts is is more than enough to hold that lightweight tube in place um, but yeah it's down now we'll work on replacing the light bulb here is what we need to get at the store get a countersunk screw with eh, we'll see if we can find uh, another one of those just ABS bushings I guess is what they are um, countersunk that might be a hard one to find and then the bulbs festoon style bulbs actually I was able to get it working again just by spinning it in the housing so it's probably just some corrosion um, but as you can see when I was removing these I, of course I broke one trying to get it out so we'll go to the store and find some new LED bulbs and some replacement screws since one of those is now at the bottom of the river All right, we 
have two working bulbs again. Uh, unfortunately, I did not find any LEDs around town. I didn't have any in stock, so I just used these halogens again for this time. I did put some dielectric grease in the sockets to help prevent the corrosion issue from happening anytime soon. Um, don't want to be doing this job too frequently. For now, we'll use these and then I'll work on getting some LEDs so that the next time it burns out, we can put those in. But now uh, to put this all back together. It's just as sketchy putting it back up as it was taking it down, especially with the wind picking up. But what I did was put a zip tie through one of the holes and pulled that tight. So that should help get the, the rest of them started and uh, be a little bit safer than trying to hold it with one hand and put the bolts in. All right, got the four bolts in that hold the anchor light tube and the four bolts tightened down that hold the track vision. And it's, it's hard to see, but the light bulb is on and working. So we have uh, repaired our corroded anchor light on the Meridian 341. Now I um, hope this helps. Um, if you guys like what you see, I know the channel's fairly new, but go ahead and click that subscribe button and we will have more videos to come. Thanks guys.